hearing shouts of fire from the adjoining pier. Workers on Pier 53 South discover they are trapped by heavy fire and seek safety in the water. At 1.10 p.m., a first alarm was struck for the fire at Box 285. Filled with combustible cargo and drums of oil, the 700 by 150 foot pier burns fiercely and quickly blankets the area with dense smoke. In less than an hour, the fire has gone to nine alarms and the three Philadelphia fireboats, along with five Coast Guard boats, a Navy fireboat, and 10 tugboats with firefighting equipment are battling the inferno. The Philadelphia Fire Department was founded on March 15, 1871. A hundred years later, the PFD had over 3,000 men and operated 70 engines, 32 ladders, three fireboats, and numerous other special units. High winds from the east push the fire and smoke inland, making it difficult for land-based companies to operate. Even master streams close to the fire are driven back by the force of the wind. The pier, now fully involved, is aflame to the waterline. Engine companies with front-mounted pumps are ordered to set up and draft from the river. An unusual design for a large city, these front mounts show why they are the pumper of choice in many areas without hydrants. Realizing the structure was lost, Streams from the fireboats are directed toward the adjacent piers. Working at full capacity, the Bernard Samuel has five streams in operation and is starting to change the color of the smoke from black to gray. In an attempt to get even more water on the fire, extra alarm engines are ordered to the water to draft. Flying embers, captured by the wind, fall throughout the city, causing spot fires blocks away. Dozens of calls were received by the fire alarm room for fires on roofs and in backyards. At the height of the pier fire, two alarms are struck for a fire on the roof of the Rising Sun Baptist Church. At nearly the same time, 
other flying embers ignited a four alarm fire at the Lombardo Rag Company on South 2nd Street. Although it will be days until the last units are returned to quarters, the men of the PFD had the nine alarm fire at box 285 under control within two hours. Disciplined and well-trained, the men of the Philadelphia Fire Department demonstrate their skill in bringing a major fire under control.